John Key and I'm a rising second year medical student at the Albert Einstein College of Medicine and I am also the current diversity director on the PAMSA National Board. So I was a little bit hesitant to run for a position in the beginning because I didn't see much involvement from other South Asian students and that seemed a little bit discouraging to me. But I think that that actually wound up being a really important reason that I did get involved. For a PAMSA to be representative of Asian American populations it's really important to have diverse perspectives, whether that be from a cultural standpoint or any other form of diversity. So, in the end, I joined a PAMSA because representing my culture was something that's really important to me. And I wanted to make sure that even through medical school, that was something that stuck with me. And I've loved being involved with the projects and events that celebrate and advocate for my culture, and a PAMSA really helped me do that. I was also really appreciative because throughout the last year, I've watched a PAMSA National Board take on diversity initiatives as a priority. They made me feel incredibly welcome and everyone was so willing to help out in my initiatives to expand the South Asian community within a PAMSA. And even within the last year, I've watched the involvement expand to include a more diverse population. And it's amazing that this organization values something like this. So I encouraged others, especially from underrepresented Asian groups like South Asians, Southeast Asians, Pacific Islanders, etc. to run for a position. It was a really rewarding experience and I met a lot of great people who were involved in making big changes. And in order to make some of these big changes for everyone, we need voices from all of the Asian subgroups. So I really encourage everyone, especially if you're from an Asian minority group, to run. And of course, feel free to reach out to me if you have any questions. My name is Francis and I'm a second year student as well as current co-president of the APAMSA chapter on the Medical College of Wisconsin campus. Why I decided to apply for a co-president position was really because I saw a unique opportunity to not only further the work of our organization, but also find more ways to build a stronger and more cohesive sense of community on our medical college campus. What I really enjoy about our chapter is the large breadth of resources and services that we offer to community members and the different folks that we get to work with as well, whether it's high school students, pre-medical students, or members of the Southeast Asian community in Milwaukee. And I think why I would encourage folks to apply for a position on an e-board would be because of the fact that we come from such diverse backgrounds within the Asian Pacific Islander term that we bring such unique voices and perspectives to leadership. And any time that we can bring any of those voices or ideas to the conversation, we're able to not only improve upon existing programming, but also find ways to innovate and continue to build upon the legacy that has been created for us, before us. Hi, my name is Panmali, and I'm a second year medical student at the George Washington University. I joined APAMSA to be part of a group that creates dialogue about the Asian community and medicine. There is a stereotype where every Asian studies to be a doctor, but the ironic part is that a lot of Asian families, especially immigrant Asian families, still prefer herbal medicines and traditions over Western medicine, my family included. As an Asian American medical student, I think it's important to touch upon these cultural differences and beliefs about medicine and talk about how we can provide more culturally sensitive care to the diverse Asian community. So far, I have really enjoyed being involved in APAMSA because I have met some of my closest friends here. I have met incredible people who are extremely passionate about making sure that the unique health issues and needs of the Asian communities are addressed. I have also learned a lot about other Asian groups and about their own unique health needs and cultures. But the best part is that we are all here to promote the health of all of our communities. On that note, I would really encourage others to join APAMSA because it is a wonderful, amazing group of people who all share a passion for promoting the health of our communities and making sure our voices are heard in conversations about diversity in healthcare. My name is Bargvin. I'm former president of the GW School of Medicine's chapter of APAMSA and current member of the APAMSA National Diversity Committee. I joined APAMSA because in APAMSA, I saw so many kind-hearted and wonderful people working hard to make a difference in our APIA communities, and I thought I want to be a part of that. Efforts such as these 
are part of creating a future of diversity and inclusion. We encourage you to get involved with the PAMSA if you're a member of an underrepresented subgroup because we need your voice. If everyone has a seat at the table, if we stick up for each other, not only will all our voices be heard, but we will speak up together with one voice that is stronger than the sum of our parts. Or as Phil from Wang Fu Productions said in Yappy, if we stick together, we can progress faster because we can share everyone's wins. Together, we will make a difference and starts with you. Are you in?